How we doing? Okay, man. Probably end up going with a bridle. Do you have a bow cleat in the middle or two on the side? Metal. Right. So we'll just this? Yep, so we'll right. stick with that. We'll just have him push it out. We'll do a hip toe until we get out of here. All right. Like on that side, I would nose up into the dock. Just keep the boat in gear. And then it just keeps us right against the dock and we can pull him out. But since we have the lift motors right there, I can't do that. Uh, so we'll get all three. Okay. So if you want to come up to the front and just help walk them back. Let me get a little closer for you. So put that one right on the one right in front of the windshield. Just go through the middle of the cleat. And then Bobby, take that back to our cleat. What you want? Just take it back to our cleat. There you go.
magnifying glass and stuff and all the deteriorating. It's getting detailed basically periodically, but not enough. Yeah. I'm not used at all. <coughs> so. It's amazing that a boat just sits around, gets worse than a yes. boat that's used. <laughs> if I had only known it would have just been better to just get a pilot and use it all the time. Get out of the habit on these things. Get down hill. This boat really doesn't like turning to the left with a boat on a hip. So you use more reverse on your port instead of keep them both forward and turned all the way to the left, it won't turn. Kind of just start pushing sideways. So apparently they're there to noon today. What was that? Apparently they're Mar there to noon. Marine today. Max? Max. So he said just dump it off at the west dock or the center dock. Okay. Use their lines, tie it up. And Second. Yeah, we'll go with the bridle. Okay. Yeah, so we got it back here. Let's undo the bowling on that one. You know, a trick with the bowling on your tail end, break that yeah. one down. Rookie. <laughs> Let's see if I can get it back on there. You got a knot in there. I usually tie a relatively big one. Yeah. Make sure you got plenty of tail left. That big or more? That's fine. Good enough. All right. There you go. You want to unleash him now or hook him up now? So we'll always hook him up first. All right. You always want to make sure we have something to control. Just figure the center toe is too weak. Uh, it's a little low down. It's under your uh, the anchor. anchor, so it's a little hard to get to. that line over the uh, cleat up there, Bobby. Good.
Yeah, I'll go bring it all the way back to neutral. Right, it can go forward. I'll take over. This is where we earn our money. Thanks, let's see it. Now we go on the ins we had to take them inside. That's you ain't What was that? It's like a step one of the Yeah. Big thing is coming here, always make a really big turn just so you have lots of time to line up. Never be afraid to bail out of it. One good thing is they've got pilings on the ends, so you're not going to at least hit the concrete. Oh, bounce yeah. off pilings, but still not something you want to do. Yeah, go ahead and do it. And we're going to put that on the stern. Here? Yep. Hey, pull it tight. Might be easier to go off the tow post. That should be good. You want him in there? Hey. That makes it easier.
If you want to come up here and get ready to cast off that front one. Hey, go ahead. Got a little bit of a bump here. I'll come get you. <laughs> You're stuck here now. <laughs> Made it look easy. Oh, you guys helped bring it there instead of having us put over there. <laughs> yeah, it would have been tight over there. Yeah. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Uh -huh. 